Stressed out about school? Don't panic. Or if you do, just remember, it's all in your head, literally. Anxiety is the brain's way of telling us to watch out for danger. It came in handy back when we were fighting off predators. But sometimes, the brain can't tell the MCAT from a wildcat. Let's say you sit down to take an exam. Sure, you waited to the last minute to cram, but you're not worried. You know you're gonna nail this one. But just as your professor's passing out the test, your heart starts racing, your palms get sweaty, you can't remember a single thing on the exam. What's going on? Stress can activate the amygdala, AKA the emotional center of the brain. If the amygdala starts freaking out, it sends signals to the hypothalamus, which regulates the central nervous system. That can cause your blood pressure to rise and your heart rate to speed up. It could also stimulate release of a hormone called cortisol, also known as the stress hormone. Cortisol can make it harder for your brain to access short-term memories, which is why you suddenly can't remember those formulas you crammed last night. If you find yourself panicking during an exam, put your pencil down and take a few deep breaths. This resets the stress response, allowing you to regain focus and control. And here's another tip. Start studying earlier and in small chunks, instead of waiting until the last minute. That way, if you do get anxious, you'll have your long-term memory to fall back on. 